Hi, my name is Tamara. Welcome to my channel. Today we are talking about top five Latafa fragrances. Now, if you know, Latafa is killing the game right now with their dupes. They are long lasting. They're amazing. Siage projection is amazing with Latafa. So when you think Middle Eastern, most time I think Latafa because I know I'm gonna get a good one. I can easily blind buy a Latafa knowing it's gonna be good. So if you want to find out what my top five Atafa fragrances are, then please keep on watching. Let's jump right in. We are going to start with the newest one from the line, and this is Eclair. This is who? This is Eclair. This is supposed to be a dupe for Bianco Latte. When I tell you this is about 97% to Bianco Latte. I've said it before, you don't need Bianco Latte if you have this the more this sits the creamier it gets the long last the more long lasting it gets this is fairly new so it's not going to perform as a one-to-one -one as bianco latte because this was this was this came out in may of this year but if you give it some time because now i have it for a little bit longer it's actually getting creamier than um when i first got it this is a yummy sweet scent you get the caramel this is long lasting project you get compliments even the bianco latte the bianco latte is one of my top most complimented perfume this is also the same thing it projects and the sillage the sillage in this one is amazing this will give you eight plus hours on your skin and more on your clothes when i tell you they did a good one with this one um it's not as creamy the, the bianco latte is still very a little bit more creamy and more refined than this one but as I said, this one is new. So the longer it sits, the more it macerate is creamier and more long lasting it's gotta get. This one, I do recommend this more for colder weather. Um, this is not a summer fragrance in my opinion. So I think once it started getting cold, I'm thinking late September, I'm gonna be starting to reach for this one again. And by that, it will be sitting for a few months. I know I'm gonna get even more long lasting, uh, more projection from it when it gets a little bit creamier this one it is so amazing they did such a good one with this one you get a little honey you get some caramel in this one with the praline and the vanilla very sweet but not overly sweet or cloying it's the dry down in this one you have to love gourmand to love this one very sweet not overly sweet very beautiful blend of the notes some of the notes in this one you have the caramel the sugar the milk and it's not overly lactonic or milky or creamy. It's just a nice, just enough milk to blend with, with the notes. You have the white musk, the white flowers, then the base is where you get the vanilla, the praline and the musk. So the dry down has that musk, so it's not just sweet, just straight sweet. It has that musky dry down. Again, highly recommend this one. This is under $50 and it lasts, so you can't go wrong. If you want, if you love gourmand, you love vanilla, and you love to smell sweet and you want to get compliments i would say definitely put get your nose on this one try this one highly highly recommend now if you have this or you have bianco latte let me know which one you like better or if you have this let me know how you feel about this but i highly recommend this one also i want to know what is your top latafa perfume if it's not on this list and i see a lot of people talking about their top latafa perfume best believe i'm gonna get it so i want to know please comment let me know what you highly recommend um, for me to pick up because i love latafa perfume now the next one that we're going to be talking about is an oldie this one came out and it's so popular but it's popular for a reason this is camera by Latafa. Look at the bottle. It's a heavy, heavy, heavy bottle. My juice is getting brown, so it's been sitting for a, a, a while now. So it is, it's macerated. This is good now. But this one is a heavy, high quality bottle. Latafa comes good with their bottle. Their bottles are high quality. When you first lift it, you think you pay a ton of money for it. No. This one it's supposed to be a dupe for angel share now i did not like angel share because it was too heavy on the booze i feel like it was just too boozy and for me i would have to be careful where i wear this one this one is more wearable it is different though i don't think it's a dupe for angel share i think this has its own category it's a it's a scent on its own it's beast mode it's long lasting it doesn't have the heavy booze or the heavy heavy cinnamon 
as um, the angel share and it's more wearable you know so if angel share was too much for you then I think and you like the DNA of it somewhat then I think you will like the camera they have another one too that came out I think it's camo aqua or something that's a little bit lighter than this one as well but I do prefer this one this one is long lasting beast mode projects gonna give you compliments it's a little bit sweet not overly sweet so don't think crazy cookies gourmet no it's just really enough the, the vanilla is enough to give it that sweetness this is also this is for cold weather so no, this is not for right now this is for once it's starting to get um, cold once it's starting to get cold this is gonna be my scent every time I wear this one I get compliments now this has dates but it's not heavy dates so if you're if you don't like dates don't think that the dates is gonna take it over no it's not gonna take it over because I think what I think what stand out most to me in this one is the tonka bean and the vanilla and the praline in this one this one is really pretty it's a great alternative to angel share plus the price point so if you want to try something and you don't want it you want to smell like angel share but you don't want to pay the price and you don't like that strong boozy I'm opening with in that you get with angel share I think you will like this one not a one-to-one -one dupe it is different it takes on a different DNA and a different direction from the original angel share so I really really love this one the notes in this one it has the cinnamon the nutmeg the bergamot um, praline tuberose and then in the base you have the vanilla tonka bean amberwood myrrh benzoin now the next one we're gonna be talking about is so popular but it's popular for a reason and this was popular last year and it is still popular this is nebra when i tell you this is a creamy beautiful little bit fresh but not fresh take on gourmand this is a beautiful vanilla scent this is so creamy so rich so luscious it's also long lasting and it projects now this is supposed to be a dupe billy irish you can get at Ulta, but for some reason i still prefer this one I smell both and I have this one and I love this one this is you it opens with a little bit of freshness with some fruits but it dissipates it, it turns into a vanilla a gourmand scent not crazy sweet not overly gourmand but a nice vanilla scent this is gonna get you compliments think creamy vanilla ambery a little bit of sugar just think of amber sensual scent this can be good for date night this is good for evening this is if you want to get compliments you want to smell so beat but not annoying but sexy as well i would say get this one this one was love at first sniff i first met this at the mall and i was out of, i was in love i was like have to have it i bought it on amazon because where they they were selling this for like way more than what it was really the original price so i got it off amazon but love at first sniff if you love your vanilla if you love your creamy if you like a little bit opening with some freshness or so a little bit of freshness in this one with a dry down a nice creamy luscious vanilla then i would say get your nose on the brass this is really so beautiful i'm so sexy date night worthy compliments it's gonna project it's gonna get you it's gonna last on your skin again this is gonna give you about six hours i don't think it gives you more than that but a good solid six hours this on, on my skin and another one another thing too if you just buy let it sit because latafa perfumes the longer they sit the better they perform better you get a feel of the scent so definitely let it sit if you just get it but this one even if you have your vanilla and you have gourmand it is different like for example this is a vanilla this is a vanilla but there are two different takes on vanilla they're so different and um, they have similar notes but they even they still smell different so even if you have a clear you can still get nebraska because it is so creamy so luscious so beautiful sweet but not as sweet as the eclair love this one as well now another one that is sweet that i highly recommend that is also a dupe um, for something and this is and some gold this is supposed to be a dupe for oriana by perfumes the marley this is sweet now oriana i like but i didn't love it and i wanted to like oriana so badly because my daughter's name is ariana but it was too sweet too too sweet they also said this could be a dupe for love don't be shy when you first spray it you're not really gonna get it but after a while you're gonna see what they're talking about it's a good 
black i think it it reminds me of both however the dry down it's more ariana for me this is very close to ariana so if you like that sweet scent and the sweet perfume then and you don't want to pay the price for um the ariana i would say try this wear this see how you feel about it and if you still love it and you want the you know the little bit more expensive take on it then i would say that's when you get ariana but it is yeah the dry down is so close to ariana pottery it's not too sweet so it's not overly sweet and annoying it has a citrus in the opening so it gives you a little bit of burst of freshness when you first spray it but then after a while it doesn't smell fresh to me it just smells really sweet very powdery very creamy in, um in the base latafa did another good one with this one because it smells so close to ariana i don't think it's as sweet as ariana to be honest with you i still believe that ariana is still a little bit sweeter if ariana was too sweet for you then give this a chance because i think you will like this i do really enjoy it and surprisingly i didn't love the oriana but this one i do really enjoy and some of the notes in this one mandarin orange and pear so that's where you get the freshness in the opening but it really goes away in the middle notes you have sweet notes jasmine and rose and in the base you have vanilla musk and raspberry so it's all sweet it's all sweet notes and that's why it is so sweet but it's a sweet fruity no so the vanilla and the musk you smell in the dry down the jasmine and the rose i think those are the ones that stand out most to me again this is handsome gold and this is supposed to be a dupe for oriana definitely get your nose on this one if you like your sweet perfume if you like and the final one top five that is going to round off our top five today um this is fairly new so it hasn't really sit and macerate in my collection as yet longevity i don't know yet so if you have this let me know if you like it this is heavily influenced from tiktok this is hype on tiktok and it's it has reason when you first this is by the way this is maya or maya i don't know if you could see maya um when you first spray think about champagne it has that fizzy burst of freshness fruitiness it has a lot of fruits but it has some sweetness in the dry down Ooh, literally think about a champagne with some fruits it is so pretty the opening is pretty that fizziness gives me that fruitiness but it also gives me a sweetness like a cotton candy sweetness so really really sweet mix i don't know if it's from the fruits or if it has cotton candy in the nodes i don't know where that cotton candy smell is coming from but it does give me that cotton candy sweetness with a burst of fruits let's see the fruits oh it has lychee raspberry violet leaf then it has the peony white rose jasmine and then base it has the the musk and the vanilla in the base with some jasmine nice powdery vanilla musky scent so it's not crazy sweet don't i don't think gourmand when i think about this but when you pour champagne think about sangria it may it give me a sangria feel that's what it gives me when you're it's hot and you're drinking a nice glass of sangria so champagne mixed with some fruits i don't know where i'm getting the champagne from but i'm getting that fizziness from the champagne but it's a burst of freshness fruity and it's the fruits that make it so fresh it dries down to a nice vanilla musk so think jasmine musk and vanilla in your dry down that's always a beautiful combination so you can't go wrong if you have jasmine musk in your dry down and vanilla it's not overly sweet so it's not as vanilla sweet vanilla it's just enough vanilla to give it a nice little sweetness but the opening on this one is so amazing longevity no it literally disappeared after a few hours but again this is less than a week in my collection so i'm not ex i wasn't expecting it to be long lasting because again it's fairly new i will see i don't know if you have this and it's long lasting let me know if you have it for a while and it's long lasting i want to know because it didn't give me a long lasting vibe but it's something that if you're running out you want to smell fresh if you are running errands or you're going out and you just want to smell fresh on a hot summer day then i would grab this nothing to think about you just grab and go this would be a good one because it's going to give you that burst of freshness fruitiness with a little bit of musk in the dry down with some vanilla love this one and i can't wait for this to macerate and really give me the true feeling of it because what i'm saying right now may not be what i say in a few months because of how new this is but highly recommend you get your nose on it i think it's under 40 dollars very affordable and it's really also good for spring summer so that is it those are my top five 
Latafa fragrances that you I think everybody should have in their collection. All five of them will probably get you under 150. They're affordable, they're long lasting, they're beast modes, they're gonna give you compliments and they're just really, even though they're dupes, I feel like they're all different in their own right. So highly recommend you get your hands on them. If you have one of them and you love them or you don't, please share, comment and let me know. And please don't forget to let me know which Latafa I should get. Thank you so much for watching and I would love to see you in the next one.